we're going down to uh, This necessary. Brenda, I don't, I don't know anything Lily, about No, no, don't, 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 I, come here. Don't make me. No, no. Don't grab me on. What the hell's with you? What the hell's with me? You leave me sitting over there so you can have some long, intense conversation with Lily? You told her, didn't you? No, I did not. And I'm getting real sick of having to re-explain myself every five minutes. The only reason I'm not telling you what's bothering me is because I won't break the confidence of a friend. Now, what I want you to do is chill out about this damn secret and forget about this jealousy bit you have over Lily because you're starting to really upset me. How much do you hate the looks of that? A lot. Let's go. Oh. Listen, you take him, I'll take her. Okay. You oh. think it's... No, 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 it was. No, it wasn't. It was doing... By me, and how she meets me. Exactly. It wasn't doing anything. Brenda, I would love a dance right now. Yeah, hands right now. Hurry, though. Hey, lighten up, okay? My wedding. My wedding, okay? Come on, come on. Hey, everybody, come on and dance with me. They're gonna have to tie some weight to your feet because you're gonna float oh, to the top no, of the no, church. No, you can float me down the aisle as if I were a balloon in the Thanksgiving Day parade. Oh, no, better yet. Oh, I'd like to just, just, just saunter down the aisle on my father's arm. It'd be oh. pretty tough to fly Carmine. Hey, <laughs> just like I dreamed it would be when I was a little girl. Girls still dream about weddings? I, I thought that was kind of passe in today's world. Oh, I don't know, that just shows how much you know. Women have options today. Absolutely right. Marriage is a matter of choice. And I too, Nedley. Oh. Whoa. You are my dream, my vision, and the thought of you walking down the aisle in grandmother's wedding gown. Oh. You're wearing this ornament gown? Oh, yeah. Oh, well, I'm a sucker for tradition. I mean, you wouldn't know it by looking at me, I know. But, see, I wanted to wear my mother's wedding dress, but it got eaten by squirrels, right? Well, I tried on every single wedding dress in the entire United States of America. Each one was uglier Very than the ugly. last, right? So then, Mrs. Q, God bless her soul, she comes up with this brainstorm. I try it on. Absolute perfection. <laughs> it's just nerves. It's just nerves. Uh, yeah, I hope I can shut up long enough to get down the aisle. <laughs> you have nothing to worry about. You're going to make a beautiful bride. Oh, thank you, Lily. That's so sweet. But I do think that there is going to be a chance I'm going to be shown up by my best person here. <laughs> Get out of here. Everybody knows who the star of this wedding is. And I think it's time for the star and everybody else to get on board and party! Woo! 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 You know, uh, when time comes, you're gonna make a knockout bride yourself. There you are, darling. Watch your step. Don't, don't say it. not about us, You know Brenda. what, Sonny, it is about us, because I've been putting up with this for months and months, you know, this thing about you not wanting to talk to me about your business interests or your personal interests. Oh, man. And I can tell that there's something really heavy going on with you, and I can't even believe that once again you don't want to let me in. I think that that definitely says something about us. Great party, huh? Mm. Yeah. <laughs> How you doing? I'm okay, actually. With all this stuff happening, uh, I don't think about the rest of it. His leg's feeling a lot better. And I'm glad you came. Yeah. What's up with Brenda? Yeah, she doesn't look like she's having too much fun. It's no big deal, you know. She uh, knows something's bothering me. She gets upset if I don't share it. Right? Oh, man, I, I don't want to be causing the two of you grief. Listen, if you need to tell her that I have AIDS, 
I don't have to tell her anything. I mean it, though. I mean, she can keep a secret as long as she knows that that is what I want. It'd be good for you to tell a couple of people who are close to you, too. I'll tell them when I'm ready. Okay, I, I will. But for now, you can go ahead and tell her, Sonny, okay? I don't, I, yeah, but I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait till after, you know, if I'm gonna tell her, I'll wait till after the wedding, okay? So if you change your mind, just let me know. No, it's fine. It's just one less person that I'll have to tell myself, okay? And one more person to give you support, too. Oh, lie. Enjoy the view, okay? Can we enjoy it together? <clears throat> this is what I propose. If you lighten up a little bit, I promise to tell you what's on my mind. You mean you're willing to betray a confidence? Well, I don't have to the person involved. I said it was okay. I will fill you in as soon as we get back from the wedding. How about now? It's, a, it's heavy stuff, Brenda. This is a happy occasion. Can, can we work on making it that for Lois' sake, for Ned's, for ours? I didn't mean to be such a pain. I didn't mean to cause you any. I love you. Goes both ways, baby. I thought you knew that by now. I just need a little reminding sometimes, you know? You know something? We should remind ourselves how, how lucky we are. You know? Everybody is. We just hit those rocks I warned you about, Mr. Quartermain. Oh. Oh, well, uh, well, uh, uh, what's the damage? Well, there's a good chance she's been holed. I'll have to go down in the bilge and assess the damage. All right, I'll, um, uh, I'll, I'll meet you there. Fine. I've radioed the Coast Guard. We might have to abandon ship. Abandon ship? My foot! Listen, listen. If anything happens, one of us has to stick close to Grandma. Okay, just get her out of that chair and we start to go down, because that thing's going to sink with the rock. Right. Go, Grandpa, go. We'll take care of the uh, 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 Ladies and gentlemen, um, it, uh, it seems that we've run aground. And around, I'm, I'm, I'm going to go uh, check on the damage. And in the meantime, just everybody just stay put. Carmine, I, I trust you to keep the troops in line up here. Uh, 
Alan? I'm here. What? Alan, you, you and Ned, come with me. Grandpa, no. All right, oh, you stay there, good boy. Please. All right, every look. Uh, look, look, folks, there's probably nothing to worry about. Oh, what is the about, folks? Oh, ships. Gracie says ships. Carmine was in the army. Does anybody know where the life jackets are at? Are there enough to go around? Oh, oh,